flaxseed gel. This is a natural gel that I use as an alternative to store-bought gels which have left my scalp irritated and flaky in the past. Flaxseeds, also known as linseeds, are native to Europe and Asia. They grow like wildflowers and just like most things found in nature, flaxseeds have an array of uses. You may have heard of flax seeds, most commonly known as a superfood, but the reason why I love flax seeds is because they promote healthy hair and scalp as it's a natural humectant, contains omega-3s and vitamin B. Flax seeds are great at nourishing your hair and defining your curls, and hydrated hair, as we all know, is healthy hair. And I'm trying to grow my hair to waist length, so subscribe to my channel to follow me on that journey. To make flaxseed gel from the seeds, all you need to do is soak the seeds in water, bring them to a boil, and then let them simmer for a little while. I usually turn down my heat from a boil to a simmer when I start to see the middle of the pot getting a little thicker. Just remember to keep stirring the pot throughout and to keep an eye on it. After simmering for about five minutes or so, I usually turn the heat off and let the gel cool down. This is a process where the gel will solidify even more. If you feel like your gel is too thick, you can always add a little bit more water, but trust me, the ingredients are so powerful, it'll work the same. You can use a strainer or a cheesecloth of some sort to separate the seeds from the gel. freshly washed and conditioned hair and I'll be using my usual products for my braid up and plus the gel for that quality combo. And here's a reminder of what the flaxseed gel looks like and y'all. I went ahead and already did the first half of my head and those braids were looking juicy. that have seen any of my videos before, you know that I am no stranger to using a lot of products on my hair. Um, I always love to use the LOC method, which is my leave-in, my oil, and my cream. This is just how I feel like my hair is moisturized optimally for the week, and that flaxseed gel really just gives it an extra kick. Let me know in the comments down below what your favorite hair product is right now. And most of you all know how to do a braid out, so I'm just gonna breeze past this, but it was Sunday, so I'm gonna share a little bit of the gospel songs that I was listening to to uplift my spirit. But yeah, keep on watching. Like I was saying, braids are pretty straightforward, but don't forget to curl your ends and at the bottom like so. Flaxseed gel is really great at moisturizing your hair and it really just defines my curls and helps to smooth everything down. And I found that, especially in the summer months when I'm in a lot of humidity, the flaxseed gel allows my hair to last much longer. That way my style can be preserved. As you all 
can see there's plenty of gel left, but I would recommend only keeping the gel for up to one week. You can always make a new batch or you can decide to freeze it the same day that you make it. All right, y'all, so this is the next day. The hair is completely dry. It is looking nice and shiny. And of course it shrunk up a little bit because the type four naturals know your hair is just gonna shrink on you and that's okay. But here I am just undoing the braids and I'm gonna fluff it a little bit. I'm going to separate the curls and also I'm going to diffuse it a little bit just to make sure that I have the roots completely dry. So this is the final look. As you all can see, my type four hair is nicely defined. It's very hydrated. This is also what my hair looks like later that day when I was recording my scalp massage video. So if you haven't seen that video, you can definitely check that out on my channel as well. And I'll leave that in the cards and in the description box. But that is all that I have for you all today. Thank you all so, so much for watching. Please let me know if you have any questions. And until next time, be blessed, stay hydrated, be productive. Peace out, y'all.